In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to clean a garlic press. So I have a, dark, a dirty garlic press and I just want to show you how easy you can clean it with. What I normally use to clean my garlic press with my other ones is that I use a toothpick. I got a toothpick and I have a potato. I'm going to tell you later what this potato does. Okay, so you might want to just stick around. So first I'm going to go, I'm going to go ahead and get around the press. And just make sure, as you can see, the toothpick is easy to pull up the skin right here from the garlic press. See how easy that comes up? And then you want to go ahead and look through the holes here. If you got garlic stuck between the holes, these little mini holes, you want to use the little old uh, um, toothpick. Just get between the holes. Make sure you get through all of them. All right, just go through all the holes there. Very, very easy. So this was very easy to clean. So we also what I like to do. I like to go ahead and skin a potato. And when I skin this potato, it's going to deodorize the, the garlic smell. And I'm going to show you exactly that. So just go ahead and get your pillar. And yeah, just go ahead and peel it off. Okay. So now that I have my potato peeled, I'm going to go ahead and cut a very small piece of it that it can fit inside the press head. Okay, like I said earlier, it's going to go ahead and deodorize that smell. You're going to go ahead and put it there, and you're going to go ahead and just mince it through like you would do your garlic press. Okay. It's going to help, like I said, deodorize the smell. Okay. There you go. And once this is done here, I'm going to go ahead and pop it off. Then you're going to go back to step number one, and that is you're going to go ahead and take your toothpick. And you're going to go back through inside of it and clean it again. All right, going back through and clean it again. Look how easy that comes up. Go back inside here, push through all the holes to get the potato out as well. And then the final step is you're going to go ahead and run it through some nice warm water. All right, you're going to run it through some water. There you go. Very simple, easy way to clean your garlic press. Now another way you can also do it, this product is very sturdy, like I said earlier, you can go ahead and put this inside your dishwasher and you will get the same results. But with me, I just like to clean it right directly at the use and it's more effective. So I hope you liked the video.